So, as usual, I was minding my own business. I promise you, I was not crying. I hate when people make videos and it's crazy conspiracy theories, and it's just outlandish and it's stupid. And you can tell they're just making it for the views, right? But this really just came to my attention, and I honestly feel like, please correct me if I'm wrong. You know, I say that a lot. If you feel like I'm wrong, correct me, but you better be respectful or I'm not replying. So, with that being said, XXX Tennessee, this guy, I, I've i seen his face around, but I didn't know his name. Let's just keep it real. I'm not going to act like I'm a fan. However, when I look in his eyes, I see something demonic. And lo and behold, this is what I found when Googling his name. Now, I didn't even have to Google his name to know he was a weirdo. Look at this. Up sound, upside down cross. But that's not what this video is about. That's just letting you know that I was on point when I look in his eyes. I see weird. I see evil. Let's just keep it real. So it reminds me of like I always talk about this when I was a kid and I was 12. I turned on the news one day. And still to this day, I haven't seen somebody so evil. This black guy was in the courthouse, and um, his lawyer was sitting next to him. I promise you, I would have got fired. Nah, I'm scared of you. But um, he looked into the camera. And I, as a 12-year-old, I was like, oh, my God. I saw demons in his eyes, right? But that's not even what this video is about. Look at this. Look, But look at this guy. He doesn't have the, you know, how people black their eyes out to make them look evil or whatever the hobson look well he puts all white with his eyes but look at this these are his regular eyes if i'm scared of you that's a problem and people are acting like they don't see this look at this they think it's cool it's so cool to be evil these days man not but here's what i found that struck me as odd Everyone knows little JoJo died recently, right? A couple of years, almost five years ago. I guess that's recent. This is XXX Tennessee. I hate his name. It's so hard to say. So we'll just call him X in this video. This is X right here, right? Doesn't this look familiar, right? Now look right here. This is little JoJo. You know, little JoJo was like 14, supposedly, when he died, right? Riding his bike. Now, why in the world would you ride your bike in what? The murder capital of the world, and you consider yourself a gangbanger, and you will tweet out your location? That never made sense to me. You don't have a car. You're not even old enough to drive. Why would you tell people you're going to be at such and such place, and you're riding a bike? Like, was he asking to die? Okay. So doesn't i need to try to find a way to put these pictures side by side but this x guy looks strikingly familiar to uh little jojo and you know what they say if you're a game banger or something you can't get out unless you die you you're not getting out of that game right so what else could you do right you could start a whole different other life. And if you really love doing music, you could definitely, like, God, what is the name of that rapper? Excuse my language, people. Uh, Titty Boy. Changed his name to Two Chains. He was not popular. I'll never forget. I was in the car with my granny. And they said, and this is Titty Boy. And she was like, <laughs> this is what y'all listen to. No, granny. He goes by Two Chains now, which is stupid. You're going to name yourself after wearing Two Chains, really? But, ooh, what happened? Oh, okay, I'm still recording. But you can literally change your name and come back in the game as a totally different other person. Somebody come in right now because I actually forgot who the person was, but it was a person who switched up their entire MO, came back as a totally different other person, and was and had a whole... A flourishing, flourishing, excuse me, flourishing career. But they couldn't cut it as themselves. They ruined their reputation so bad, right? 
Y'all tell me if this is or isn't, or do you think this is Lil Jojo? What, what, what is this weird stuff right here? What is this? Why do people think that being weird is cool? Like, okay, there's a difference between y'all. There's a difference between being weird, right? And then there's a difference between being evil. You could be weird and not be evil. You could be you. You know what I'm saying? This right here. Click it. This right here. I'm going to tell you, but, but this picture right here. This picture right here. Screams Lil JoJo. I'm going to pause the video and put it side by side. Oops, let me pause one more time. Now y'all tell me. This don't look like Lil JoJo. It is so easy to fake everything, especially when your whole persona was online and this kid was a minor. This kid was a minor. He probably got scared, and there's nothing wrong with being scared to get out of a thug lifestyle. Now, don't y'all come on here talking about, that's what Tupac did. That's what he did. Tupac was in too deep. We talking about a 14-year-old child named Lil Jojo. Oh, so arrogant was his name. Oh, so arrogant. I do not speak ill of the dead. Let's just keep that straight. Was I a fan of this? No. I do not like gangster music. I do not like thug music. I do not promote any of that bull crap because that's why our young people end up dead. Trying to be cool over the internet. You have never in the, let's see, Almost 11 years I've been on the internet, I have never posted an image of me with a gun. I have never posted something talking about, oh, I'm gang banging and da 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 da. 11 years, and I talk a lot on the internet. I have never claimed any type of gang affiliation. Nor have I tweeted my location saying, y'all come get me. No. And don't say because I'm a female, because I see females doing it too. They died on Facebook Live too, trying to be cute. And, and trying to fight over dudes or claiming they're thugs as well. I'm going to do one more side-by-side -side comparison. And then I'm going to let you guys comment and y'all can tell me what y'all think. Yeah, so I know that little JoJo had a brother or has a brother. I don't know. I guess he lays low. I wouldn't blame him, and I don't. But here's another um side by side comparison. This looks like an older version of little JoJo, or maybe this is just me wishing and hoping that he's still alive because that's just such a young life that was wasted. And I also say, I don't really speak on this because I don't mess around with Chief Keef and Glow Gang. And I don't want to be a part of no music label that has the word gang in it, death row. Can our people ever just make music without having to be hood? Can we go back to the era of uh, Ain't Too Proud to Be, uh, woke, woke Up Feeling Whatever? <laughs> you know the little old school music they're talking about. Make love, not war. Can we go back to that? Well, y'all yeah, already some slut blood, so we ain't gonna promote that. But can we go back to, well, didn't Marvin Gaye daddy kill him? You know what, whatever. I'm ending this video. Was it Marvin Gaye? Was it Marvin Gaye? Somebody daddy kills. Listen, I am at Tiffany M. Draper. Can we as a, as a generation, not as a people, I'm not gonna blame black people. Can we, as a generation, Get it together, please. That is a rhetorical question. But for the person that feels like answering that question in the comment section, please do. Please do. I'm not going <laughs> to... Add Tiffany M. Draper. You know you can find me under that handle on pretty much any social media site. And like I said, I, if you're a parent and or guardian watching this video, you don't ever have to worry about me uploading half-naked pictures. You don't have to worry about me... 
uh, uploading gang affiliation or any type of weapons, your child is safe on my social media accounts. Y'all have a good day, evening, night, morning, afternoon, whatever time y'all watching this.